AVTV is a product of the AV journalism class produced for the students of Amador Valley High School. The views expressed on the show do not represent the views of AVHS teachers, admin, or PUSD personnel. Good morning, Dons. Today is Friday, December 13th, and I'm David. And I'm Jazzy. Dons, finals are coming. That's right, David. Monday and Tuesday, December 16th and 17th are normal school days. Wednesday through Friday, December 18th through the 20th, we'll have a modified final schedule. On another note, as the holidays are coming around, it begs the question, who got the best hot chocolate? answer this unresolved question we have a segment in which we will reveal to you where you can find the best hot chocolate in Pleasanton. This week we went out to rank the hot chocolate around town and find the best one. Coming in at number three is 85 degrees. The store itself was really festive and it's a nice place to sit down with a drink and a snack. We got the classic hot chocolate and thought it was nice and hot but felt a little watery when compared to the others. It reminded us of hot chocolate mix. Tied for number two is Inklings. The store had some festive decorations, but it's mainly a place to hang out with friends or study. We got their gourmet hot chocolate. It had a lot of foam and was really creamy, but it wasn't really sweet, so we were split about it. For those who don't like overly sweet things, this is a great option. Also tied for two is Pete's Coffee. The store had some calm holiday music playing and was a pretty nice place to sit down and study with a drink. We got their peppermint hot chocolate and were pleasantly surprised. I don't normally like peppermint hot chocolate, but this one wasn't too minty. It was warm and creamy and we really enjoyed it. Our pick for top hot chocolate was Godiva. At first we were concerned by the lack of places to sit and the really small sizes, but after an employee recommended it, we tried the peppermint hot chocolate. It had such a rich chocolate flavor that it completely blew us away. The small cup lasted us for a while and was really satisfying. So our lineup was 85 degrees, followed by Inklings and Pete's tied for second, then Godiva was our winner. And there were plenty of places we couldn't fit on our list. So make sure to go out and try some hot chocolate this winter to find your favorite. Happy holidays! Dons, our Amador zoology class took a trip last Tuesday to the Monterey Bay Aquarium to learn about the wonders of marine life. Here's a recap of that exciting day out. Somewhere in the sea, somewhere waiting for me. My lover stands on golden sand and watches the ships that go sail. Fly like birds on high and straight to her I'd go sailing. It's far beyond the star, it's near beyond the moon. I know beyond. Well, that's all we have for today, Dawn. And remember, it's always a beautiful day here in Amador.
please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all.